Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to be going over CU29, and I'm basically just going to tell you guys what I think about it, so if this video doesn't really catch your interest or whatever, it's alright, I completely understand, it's just my thoughts on this game, but anyways, let's jump right into it. So, the new map, Illusion, this is like the biggest thing about the content update, right? That's what it's called, CU29, Content Update 29, I guess we've had 29 updates on this game, which is crazy, but anyways, um, this map is fucking awesome. This is a 10... I feel like saying it's a 10 out of 10 map maybe it's like a 9 out of 10 it's just like the players that i've been playing against i don't know why the players are so bad but like this shit is fun sometimes i'll get like pretty pretty good players against me but i mean damn this this map is really fun you've got two lifts that you can go for cool like clips i guess it's really hard to hit shots through that little corridor but if you do if anyone does that'll be that'll be an awesome clip two snipers on the map a sword in the middle like guys this is a fun map like this is halo this is a halo map basically is what i'm trying to tell you this is a halo map it's fun it kind of reminds me of like condemned but not a shitty map you know condemned fucking sucks this map though is awesome i like the aesthetic i love the camo and the os i love how they look i don't know how to get to them i don't know if you can get to them but they're so sick just like just looking at them like just look at these they look so nice i, I think we should bring back that style of power-ups i think they need to look like this in the next halo game that would be nice to look at i don't like whatever we have now the little like pads that the little like circle things that you put on your chest whatever it's dumb we need the old power-ups back so three for three if you ever see this video which i honestly don't think you will but if you do see this video uh bring those power-ups back a lot of us like it i know i'm not speaking alone here i i know you guys agree with me as well so the map is great i absolutely love the map and that's really it for this update and this is the bad part about the update is it's all about the money there is no content in this update you would think there'd be content in this update because it's called content update 29 right if you think that there is content in this update then you're really really dumb because if you guys go back in time and look at uber nick's videos you'll see this man had so many ideas he had content to put out because 343 had things in store for con for content creators like you could make videos on halo not just about you know playing playing a game and shooting your gun i mean obviously in his videos back then he was doing the same thing but i feel like with his first uh, what was it called first trying power up gun you know i'll show it on screen right now but that was like a thing for him to do you know it was a good idea and it gave him something to do in the game you know it wasn't just oh this content update is out i can play a new map and talk about it and i can buy some new skins even though you had to pay money for getting weapon variants in halo 5 there was still a lot to like show off there you know, it wasn't just regular Halo gameplay where you're shooting people. And it's a little bit disappointing to me because, like, Halo is everything, you know? Halo is, it's got so much to do. You got campaign to play, you can play multiplayer if you don't like the campaign, or you can play custom games with your friends. I feel like this update really doesn't do anything for that. We also did get a Forge update, which, again, I, I don't really care about because I'm not a Forger. I'm sure people will put out really cool maps but I personally do not forage because I have a small brain and I, I just also can't do like architecture type shit. That's like my main thoughts overall. Like I, I don't really care for forage. Uh, the new weapon skins are pretty cool. The only thing I will say that isn't cool is the DMR skin. That thing looks abs like do not buy the skin. It looks fucking dumb. The stanchion rifle looks sick. The classic AR looks really cool. They've put out some, they put out a lot of skins and they just overpriced them, you know? If you wanna buy the stanchion rifle, it is 20 bucks. You can't get it like separately for like, you know, five bucks and be on your way with the gun, you know? It's like, all right, I can buy the gun separately. That's cool. I don't have to buy all this other shit that I won't wear. Overall, this update was really kind of nothing. And you can just tell, I, I know, I know a lot of people have been talking about it. You can just tell that 343 is moving forward. They're gonna be making a new game. And everyone has said that in their videos about CU29. Everyone understands that, so if you already heard this a million times, I am sorry, but I also just need to, I, I feel the need to say it, because, you know, why not? But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. It wasn't really that much in this video. There wasn't really much in the update as well, so I hope you guys understand, and um, I guess that's it for the video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one.